So in this video, I'm going to have Campbell just do some blocks after practice. And I will just correct her as we go. And then this is kind of going to be like a live uh, correction video. So she'll do her runs and I'll just kind of shout things at her. So Campbell is a 400 meter runner, so she's going to start on the curve. So the big thing for her is we need to focus on really swinging the thigh forward, staying low because she's going to be on a curve. So she needs to just stay more in a swing phase or drive phase. So for that first one, you can see on the right foot, if you play it back, that right foot's going to step out real funky to the side, which tells me she's stepping and not swinging. So Campbell, make sure on that right foot, you're swinging it out to the center instead of swinging out to the side. She likes to take a real hard side step, but she needs instead her hips to basically oscillate and undulate to move to the center instead of taking steps out to the side. Her block position is kind of her personal preference. She's now in college, so I let them choose their own. If it were me, she could probably go up to 50 degrees instead of 47, I think is where she's at, or 40 degrees. 50 would be even, even good too. So you can see on that, she swung the knee harder, but she still stepped out of the blocks. There wasn't a big separation between the cheeks, meaning more of a this motion. Um, she likes to just step with the thigh instead of really pulling the leg forward. So Campbell, that was better, but I really need you to be aggressive on the swing. Uh, and the reason that it's slow is because the arms are just a tad slow. Really got to throw that arm out there, explode and pull off the blocks. Um, so make sure the emphasis would be really pulling that arm forward, not necessarily pulling the other one back. So the right leg is going forward. Therefore, all I want you to focus on is throwing your left arm as hard as you can out to the center, head down, chest down. As she gets more comfortable and we get closer to the season, she'll be more and more aggressive with these. But for right now, we're just kind of practicing some techniques slash getting back used to just being in the blocks over and over again. Because we'll be doing a lot of this at the university she goes to. And overall, Campbell is a good runner. She's a 400-meter runner. She's not the most explosive out of the blocks athlete. So you're seeing some good technique. They're not going to see a ton of big pulls out of her just purely based on size and focus of the vents since she is a more distance runner on the mid to distance up um, that was good just try to speed up that that pull explode that hand as far as you can same thing with the hip and, and blocks what i really like to focus on when we're getting in more of a preseason is pulling out of the blocks so how hard can i swing my thigh out of the blocks instead of a big swing and push so eventually she needs to get to a point where She's able to swing while pushing the leg at the same time. But a lot of times that will cause you to plantar flex and not keep your shins low to the ground. Campbell, keep your feet lower to the ground this one. Nice and low. Much better. So she kept her feet way lower and kept, she kept her shin angle more parallel than taking that first short step and then standing right up. How'd it feel? It felt just like I kind of picked it up a little bit. That was actually pretty good. Oh, uh, you didn't pick up. You actually you actually swung forward pretty good. Try it again. Keep your feet low. Uh, once again, she's a 400-meter runner, so she's not going to drag the feet as much. Um, she's also kind of an antsy person in general, <laughs> so she's going to stand up quicker because she is not super patient in the blocks. But we're working on it. She's doing a good job of it. Much better. 